Okay, hello and welcome Jyrki here and in this video I'm gonna show you very quickly how to get rid of this annoying flickering thing. Very easy and quick fix in a premiere. Choose the clip you want to fix in timeline, hold alt and copy it over the first one or if you want you can just right click copy it and paste it whatever suits you for that you should turn off the magnet choose the clip and move it one frame to the right after that go to the effects of that clip and change the opacity make it 50 and now as you can see there is a little bit flickering because it doesn't always fix it. Keep in mind, this is something you shouldn't have to do. Here is another example, these Christmas lights flicker here like crazy. And as previously done, we fix it same way. We choose it, copy it over it, then choose it, go to effects and change the opacity to 50 and as you can see there is a little bit flickering but it's almost non-existent it's not that noticeable and distracting here is good example of that slow motion you see those black bars rolling very slowly in footage and that is something that you cannot fix at least in this way i do the same trick and let's see what happens they are still there not as strongly but still there and here i'm filming with a cinema setting on with gh5 slow motion and as you can see there is this big black bar going there you cannot even almost notice it only if you pixel peep it for a long time but let's change it to ntsc which is wrong setting for my area and as you can see there is a lot of this rolling and flickering let's change to our area pal area and now there isn't any kind of flickering happening so i just wanted to show you that because it's not always possible to fix everything in post and best way to avoid this is to have settings in your camera ready and correctly before you start to film. Think about what kind of lighting you are having, what kind of frame rate you need to use. Try it before you have to film. That way you avoid all these problems and you don't have to spend time in Premiere or After Effects and trying to fix or salvage everything. Hopefully this tip helped you guys and uh, see you next video. Bye.